Jockeys in Yangon, the home of Myanmar's master chef. I was lucky to get invited to visit this famous chef. Ye Tu Win is the judge on Myanmar's version of MasterChef, a TV cooking competition. He's known as a master of many crafts and a successful entrepreneur in the new Myanmar. This is his restaurant on Damaseti Road near Svedagon Pagoda in Yangon. I sat down and waited to meet Ye Tu Win. As you'll see, he's a passionate believer in the craft of food making. He makes his own salt as well as many other ingredients. Hi, I'm Ye Shakis. I'm known here in Myanmar as uh, Mr. Shakis. My true name in Myanmar is Ye Tudwen. It's all about food and passion. But without salt, you cannot cook. Salt is one of the most fundamental element in all types of cooking. So what is sea salt? In Shakis, we do the artisanal way, which we call the traditional way of making sea salt. Every fourth night, when the high tide comes, we pump in water from the ocean. With the help of the sun, the percentage of the salt will rise up slowly. It starts to flower on the surface. Fleur de sel means flower of the ocean. Okay? This, fleur, this salt will go on, on the floor of that mud bank and it becomes grey salt. After a week, we'll drain off the top water and we'll scrape on the surface and we'll get rock salt. In a nutshell, that's how we, we do salt in Myanmar using the French technique or the Spanish technique. So here's our chicken, free range chicken coming from our farms in the southern uh, Myanmar. On Jongjo, and these are ponte chickens. Okay, chickens. And here we're roasting in our famous, uh, expensive uh, what, uh, grilling machine called Wati Salt, coming from France. And grill around about uh, 36 chickens in one dog. Listening to Mr. Sharkies makes you realize how much thought and passion has gone into this restaurant. This is the new Myanmar. This pizza oven is great for roasting chicken or so. Yeah. Finishing chicken because it has firewood plus the temperature in this oven is over 500 degrees Celsius. So you put the chicken that is cut and you crisp it in this oven. Fantastic. And of course you're going to see how we're going to do the pizza. Brilliant. You're going to see and then, so what it's going to do is here's why doing it. We'll be doing Napolitan pizza. You put it inside, watch, and in about 90 seconds, you'll start to get crisper. Better not put the camera too far in, <laughs> it'll melt. That's how it's called Napolitan uh, oven. And we're using tropical dry wood, it's very important. Totally. Yeah. Yeah. This is just a dough. You're going to see Lao Chai Loma. At this point in time, Mr. Sharkis was called away for other business. I thank him and his team for letting me visit. I hope this video gave you a good idea of Mr. Sharkis' restaurant and how entrepreneurs like him are building the new Myanmar. Please subscribe for more videos.